So, in your own words, what is pool? Um, pool. Uh, um, 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 pool's like a magical space where you can go to see all sorts of beautiful images, really interesting text, creative work, videos, all sorts of ideas and possibilities. Fantastic sound works as well. We'll leave you with a piece from the ABC's media sharing website, Pool. It's called Undokai, or Field Day, and it was created by Rose Lang, including, amongst other things, a Buddhist Nichiren morning chant, and the playful voices of Japanese children taped enjoying their own Undokai. Your ideas, your voice. I go to Pool for, to find really unique and imaginative content, content I just simply wouldn't have expected to get. I go to Pool to be surprised and to be refreshed in my program making, actually. In conjunction with the ABC's collaborative media site, Pool. Sound quality. The night share. On Future Tense. The book show on Radio National. Yeah, I know, Barney. I know, I know we all Lucinda is missing, cocooned, possibly in Australia. Like Your photo like or film could help Cornelius find her and end the story. And be a part of this unique radio drama project. Details are at pool.org.au. Time now here on ABC Radio National's Sound Quality with me, Tim Ritchie to dip our ear into a pixie cast made for pool by the artist Pixie Guts. I saw it there and I grabbed it and uh, she and I have corresponded a little and she's excited about it being played on the radio. All the artists and the details of the tracks and the country of origin is on the sound quality page. So let's not adieu and get into a pixie cast on ABC Radio National's Sound Quality. You're with 360 Documentaries on ABC Radio National. I'm Brent Clough. A year ago, producer Gretchen Miller heard a news report about the decline of bird numbers around Australia. What role do they play in our individual sense of self, as well as our national identity? These questions became a project on the ABC's pool website, a call out to our audience and the birding community to send in their reflections. Almost 400 pieces came in. A little Birdland online community sprang up through comments and the sharing and combining of stories. From these, 25 pieces of audio, music and writing were selected to go to air, along with documentary and interview material. Mm -hmm. 